This is The Lost Provinces, designed by John Krakowski. This is a game about the Franco-Thai War of 1941, and we're releasing it in, I would say, two or three weeks. So this is the situation that's set up. There's about 20 units on the side, and you have the uh, Thai player. Those are the red units that are kind of bearing in, uh, and then you have the French player, which is defending. So this is kind of like a, a mini Blitzkrieg situation. The Thai player has a lot of artillery and armor, and uh, air superiority, and all that put together gives them kind of a combined arms advantage. And they're trying to steamroller in over the French to grab some territory, and the French are trying to slow them down uh, while preserving enough of their manpower that they can maybe hit them back. So the advantage the French have, they're you know, on the defense, uh, they have kind of the advantage of interior lines because they have a lot more access to this road network and they can move, kind of shuffle units around to oppose the various Thai threats. Um, because moving along the roads, of course, gives, lets you move uh, more efficiently. Um, but you really need to be flexible with that. You can't just sit there and take your lumps and go back a hex and take some more lumps. You really need to be preserving that manpower so you can hit, hit them back. Um, the road is also important to both sides because of supply. Um, so in this game, in order to be in supply, you need to be within three hexes of a road, and that road has to trace back to a supply source that's friendly to you. And uh, if you're not, then your movement factor is halved, and your combat factor is halved, and of course, the uh, presence of an enemy in a hex is going to interdict that, that supply trace. Um, and the tie player definitely has uh, more advantages, and they're on the attack. But those advantages are kind of brittle. So here's my favorite example. So they have this tank unit, which has a, a combat factor of six, which is the highest in the game. And the uh, French, their, their tank unit only has a combat factor of three, which, uh, you know, is not that great. Uh, but when you are attacking and you suffer a step loss, which pretty much every time you attack, you're going to suffer at least one step loss. The first step loss, if you have an armor unit, has to be your armor unit. So you have the six combat factor unit, that's pretty great, but once you use it, he goes down to three and use it a second time, he's gone. Uh, so you have this advantage, but you need to be careful about how you use it and are you really getting the most use out of it. So it creates a, a nice decision space as far as how do I use the resources I have available to me uh, in the most effective way possible. And the result is actually a very tight, very close game, a very nice uh, introductory hex encounter game with a, a bit of nuance. So I really enjoy this game, and we're really excited to be publishing it, and like I said, be coming out in uh, about two weeks.